Kevin, uh, you're a family man. You come from Minnesota. I do. You come. You have a lot of uh, feedback right now with these Christian-based films. Mm -hmm. Have you found there's a market for this type of film festival? Um, have I thought about? It? Yeah. Have you thought about it before? I've, like well, getting involved with like well, family films, Christian-based films, and a festival like this. I never. I never thought about just a, a strictly a faith-based film festival in a way. I mean, I guess we talked about it once or twice, my wife and I. Sure. But, but really, um, you know, doing one like we're kicking off here this summer with the Park City International Film Festival is really uh, just to promote family-friendly movies. They don't necessarily mm -hmm. have to be faith-based or Christian yeah, movies. Absolutely. Uh, you look at the history of Hollywood, you take the top 100 grossing movies of all time, the vast majority of them are G and PG rated movies, whether mm -hmm. it's a Pixar movie or another Disney one or just some family one that, that's out there or, co or comedy. Uh, they're the ones that kind of, you know, make the most money. I mean, I've, I've always said it's called show business, right? Not right. show show. So I don't understand why Hollywood doesn't really take that clue sometimes and make more of these. And I get it. People have stories to tell that end up being heavy R-rated movies with the action, violence, or and agendas that are touchy for people to go on. But uh, to me, it's like, why not have a film festival that people will really, really enjoy and really admire? Mm -hmm.